What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Tamika. Just wanted to literally come and talk to y'all for like two seconds because I was literally on my way out the door, as you can see, on my way to work, on my way to make this money, as my girl Carly B says. But some real ignorant came across my timeline, and I just wanted to talk to y'all about it and get y'all thoughts on it because we really gonna talk about this crap today. So on my way out the door, and I had to do a double take. I'm like, what? Trick Daddy with his cornball, dusty ass actually goes on social media talking about how white women and Hispanic women are, you know, getting ass and titties. They learn how to cook better. And us black women need to step our game up because all they got to do now is learn how to fry chicken and it's over. Like, we ain't going to have no men once they learn how to do that because... Hey, all the men gonna go to them. Well, let me tell you something. Trick daddy. Trick, trick. I, I, what the fuck? I don't give a fuck. I'm just gonna call you ignorant ass, okay? Because you ought to be ashamed of yourself. You, as a black man, should never have had those words come out of your mouth. How dare you? First of all, that's what I want to know. How dare you? Somebody who comes from a black woman. How dare you sit up there and use what little platform that you have to downgrade and disrespect us black women? Instead of why instead of doing that, why don't you use again what little platform that you have and talk about how we get up every day, go to work, go to school, come home, cook meals. Take care of our kids and our men, okay? We ain't new to this. We true to this. Why don't you talk about that? Why don't you talk about all the women who do that, okay? And who've been doing that. All right? While you sitting up there talking about we need to step our game up, let me tell you something. You need to go sit down in what my girl Tiki44 calls the fuck section, okay? Because everything you said didn't even make fucking sense. Talk about stepping our game up. Negro, are you serious? We bust our butts every freaking day to maintain, okay? If anything, I should t I should get on social media and tell your dumb, dusty ass to step your game up because you are definitely the definition and the representation of the lazy black man, okay? All you do is just sit up on social media and do what? And talk shit all day? Nigga, get a job. How about that? All right, you talking about we need to step our game up. You need to step your game up. Because no self-respected black woman. I mean, you have nothing. You have nothing. What have you contributed to the, to the African-American race? What positive contribution have you made? Okay? None. And I ain't talking about uh, making a positive contribution just because you were once upon a time famous, okay? Because we know that's long and gone, okay? You know, dead and stinking. But what I am saying, even as a, as a grown black man, what positive contributions have you made, okay? I mean, we got people dying every day. Why don't you talk about that? I mean, why don't you, like, again, I say, why don't you stop being the stereotypical lazy black man instead of trying to tell us black women to step our game up? Okay, nigga, you ain't shit. I mean, I ain't never seen you doing nothing positive for the community or none of that. I never hear you talking about, you know, taking care of your family. All I hear about is you broke, you broke, you broke. And, you know, now... I guess you're going to be on Love and Hip Hop or whatever, so that might change. But you know what? I don't give a fuck about that. All I'm saying is, look, you got your nerve. Because you don't, you have not done anything but perpetuate, the, like I said, the lazy black man. And guess what? Us black women don't want you, okay? So... A white woman, a Hispanic woman, they can have you, okay? Since we quote-unquote need to tighten up, 
they can have you, Trick Daddy, okay? Because we don't want you. In the words of my brother, Alex Rogers, Trick Daddy, fuck you. Bye-bye, y'all.